Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. And um, I know I already posted today, if it comes out today. It might not come out today, but um, I made it on the same day I made the other bracelet video. Um, and I, I just don't have school today, so I'm taking advantage of that. Um, anyway, again, doing bra another bracelet, um, ripping up bracelets. And I really like the color combo of this one, or co combination? Co compilation? I don't know. Um, and, um, it's just really cool. Uh, except I decided since this probably wouldn't be enough for the design I'm doing, I wanted to add a little more black and some white. So this is kind of a panda domino theme, and this is a kind of cool neon one with some black. Um, now I did this on my own. A lot of these I, uh, did on my own, um, because I started YouTube, like, I don't know, a week ago, and, uh, I made this line, and this is a, um, kind of combo of my, my style, and made by Mommy's style, and she, uh, did a pencil hugger with this same face, um, uh, so I decided to use that, uh, face, uh, or, like, you know, how to do the main, since I didn't know how to do that, and then I decided to add my type of style body, so, um, just search Made by Mommy's, uh, channel, she doesn't really post, uh, and make sure to put Loom, because she does Looming most of the time, um, but, um, she doesn't really post anymore, sadly, a lot of Loomers don't post a lot, but, um, you know, that's fine, you could, she saw some, a lot of tutorials, you might know her, anyway, uh, if you want the tail to go up, you can leave it like this, or you can kind of pull it upwards, to make the head not like that, you just basically fold back, fold it backwards and do some stuff to, you know, oh, there it is, it's, it's good, so it's super cute, um, that everything is my design except the head, um, but yeah, so, um, I'm actually not gonna rip this right now, cause, you know, um, it, it, like, my parents might talk or something, um, but yeah, this is just a normal finger chain, um, I really know what to call it, it's pretty basic. Okay, so as always, um, also this is kind of a tutorial, but kind of mixed up some cool stuff. I could have just pulled these apart off camera, but I'm not going to do that. <clears throat> anyway, um, you're going to need your hook and your loom, as always, and bands. <laughs> these are my bands. And also, you know, this little guy is, um, let's just move him away. We don't need him right now. And what is that? Also, again, if you want me to do that um, video where I uh, you know, pick blindly, go check out the video um, that I did, um, and I mentioned the jar. I have it right here. Um, you can see some of them. Uh, and here's a lid as proof. It has a pop thingy. It's super cool. Anyway, yeah. Um, so go like that video. Um, you can go ahead and just go ahead and check all my videos because I said it at the start somewhere and then like that one or just like all of them. That would be great. Uh, anyway, um, uh, also I'm doing likes because I can't, you can't comment on my videos for some reason. Hopefully that gets fixed though. Okay, right, so your loom and your hook. So let's get started. I'm going to do it on, nope, still on this side. Okay. Here, I, I made my camera a little weird, so please don't follow. How am I supposed to do this? Okay. I really don't want this to fall. There we go. That's some nice quality. Okay, so I'm going to start ripping up my thing. Take it apart. There we go. Okay, so first take your first band which is stuck for me why do you gotta be stuck do i have to unstuck it okay, first let me take the c-clip out and put it somewhere okay so um here's the line so there's some steps you need to do so first is the top of the, of the line um so double bands and this is the um part that you can make it a keychain yeah and grab my other two 
okay and this is gonna kind of look like a zebra oh god it's gonna look like a zebra isn't it that's not what i'm going for okay first i'm gonna do this Ding. and then now i'm gonna take my neon colors because i'm not going for zebra also uh i should probably do it that way anyway okay actually no take these off hopefully that wasn't too much work for you because you're taking it off okay so uh i didn't plan this out that well we're just gonna go with it because that's what i'm basically doing uh just take that out please okay got it and i'm gonna need a few more please just that many thank you and a thank you uh unfortunately we are using still double bands but so you want to take this uh she did it a little differently in her tutorial um mm, but this is easier so put on your hook like this take your white band and white band i don't know why i said okay, just take your double bands and push those on Grab it off. Since I had an outrageous number of bands, I just went crazy. But here I have a budget. So put that there. Slide them all to the middle. And now you want to do that again. So um, first take your colors you're using for the main. Um, I'm going to take about three this time. Even though I used a different number that I got the wrong. Yes, I did. Okay. So now take all these bands. Okay, so put those on there. Uh, okay, there. Okay, and now take your double bands. Oh, okay. It's like, no, I don't want to be a lion. Sorry, I, I'm, I'm acting. Weird. Okay, so like that, like the other side. And just keep doing that for the entire head. So we're going to be doing this. So take your double bands first, and then take your main colors. I don't know why I used four for that other one. It's fine though. Also, you're gonna need two bands for the eyes. And there, if you can hear my parents talking. <laughs> I was trying to scare you if you didn't know. Because I'm just so funny. Uh, there you go. And do that again. I'm gonna just keep going. I'm not, I'm gonna do it a little faster. You know what to do. Hopefully. Uh, if you don't, rewatch the other. Um, rewatch what I just did. Uh, so yeah. Um, or I'll just do it again here. You know, that's fine too. Hopefully you didn't already go rewatch the other parts because I'm doing it right here. Uh, unless you pause the video. But I can tell you didn't because you're watching. I'm just joking. Okay, so now just put it in the middle. Just ignore the main band. The only thing you want to do is just move them perfectly. In the middle and we're doing that side now uh, I'm fine okay and one two three and I'm already running out soon if I do I don't know what I'm gonna do probably improvise and not do the main anymore actually no i have a perfect idea i'm actually fine i have a good idea it's fine guys so now you should be about here uh you should have finished one row if you're not then you want to go ahead and do that since this is a little more complicated than doing just normally doing it normally um if you want to do a girl lion it's basically just doing it without these but it's going to be very hard to identify it's line Okay, so now you want to do that another row. 
um, put that there. I'll, I'll do this on camera, because, um, I know it's kind of weird when I'm not on camera, so, uh, sorry about that. <clears throat> My throat's not scratchy, I just, I don't know, maybe it is scratchy. I keep going off camera, but it's kind of hard. Okay. Put that there. And push it down. Make sure to always push it down. Hopefully I'm not telling you this too late. But yeah, it's it's best to push it down so it um doesn't fall off. And pushing it down is probably the best option. I don't know what else to say. Uh but yeah. So remember we're putting the main colors on first, the colors you're using for the main, not your body colors, the colors you're using for its hair, okay? And then your main no i'm sorry uh for confusing you um then take your uh colors you're using for the entire body mm. so and i'll give you an example i know you probably already know this um like red for me it would be red so first rainbow colors and then red that's what, that's what i would do if i was doing that <laughs> lion so taking three you can do, like, even, like, ten on one, except that's going to be a lot. Um, so that's why I'm doing three. The other one I did, I, I'm pretty sure I did four on each one. Um, or maybe I did the whole rainbow. I, I'm forgetting. I'm pretty sure I, I didn't do it that long ago, but I still have a blurry memory. Actually, I did the, I think I did the full rainbow on each one. Um, uh, yeah, I did, no, but I'm starting to see red. I don't know. I'm sorry for confusing you, but I did I did some colors. Um Yeah. <laughs> uh you can do it as many uh ones as you want. You can do as many colors as many as you want. That's you know just be creative. You can use whatever colors. It doesn't have to be brown if you don't have brown. If you only have brown, then you know, you can use brown. You can be using only one color. That would be cool. Um, I know if I only had one color, I would do that. Because I'm making a literally neon ze <laughs> zebra. I'm making a literal zebra. So, you know, zebra line. Okay, so uh, we do not put the hairy, hairy bands on these. I'm pretty sure I'm looking back at it. And, it, and I am sure... Of it, and it's perfect here so take double bands all these are double bands except the furs so everything is double bands the only non double bands are your little parts you're making the main uh with so basically the things that make it a line lion lion I'm, I'm good at saying it, but now hearing me say it, it, it sounds wrong. Not like wrong, wrong. I mean, like, it sounds like I'm saying it wrong. Okay, there we go. So now we have the head. Uh, I think my sister is laughing at me. Okay. Uh, now we're going to do the neck, which is just double bands. If you want it to be a chubby line, then do um, uh, triple bands. Okay, so now I'm going to have to start using these. I'm almost out, though. So I'm probably going to do this, what I'm about to do, and you're about to see. Um, here. And here. If you hear that dribbling noise, it's my fish tank. I might show you one day. He's a beta fish, in case you were wondering. Okay, and here. And now, last time, we're going to do it on this side. Uh, you don't have to do this order I'm doing. Just um, be doing what I'm doing in whatever color you want. Uh, you can even do it here, but I'm not because I'm doing the belly a little different. So, I'm going to take double bands of, my two, of two of my colors and put them here. Which one of them is actually technically black. Uh, actually, it is black. But okay. Now I'm going to make the whole body a, the rest of, the whole rest of the body, this color, 
Um, so yeah, just follow along. I'm realizing that this is going to be a kind of tie-dye color, which I'm fine with. It'll look cool. This is basically how you do tie-dye, just two different colors at once. Okay, now these are the thighs, I'm quite sure. Let me check. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, <laughs> I don't know why I said that. Uh, so I'm, we just have to do one more row. And here, so just follow along. And I will show you what the whole thing looks like in a bit after I do this part. Okay, and now we're going to be doing the legs. I actually might have enough bands for this. Oh, you know what? I don't want it to be too matchy. So we'll put it over there. Hopefully that doesn't throw the whole concept off. There we go. Now I, you should add something like this. Um, I'm going to do it sideways. Uh, I'm really sorry, but I kind of have to. Because um, I don't want to knock the camera over. There. You can make it a little longer if you want. We totally have some room. Um, now we're going to do... Oh, the tail. No, the tail, the tail, the tail. Oh, and my dog's barking. I hope he doesn't bark again because I'm sorry. And he's barking. You know what? You can hear my dog barking. Dog barking, Perry. And he's stuck. Oh. Is he going to do it again? Nope. Oh, okay. Uh, I don't know if you can hear that. It would be weird, really weird if you can hear that. <gasps> Oops. Okay. Now we're going to do the cat bands. So first we're going to start with the top. Uh, so you should have these two bands here. So the legs and then the arms. Wrap them around three times. So that's one, two, oops, and three. And same with the opposite side. I've never really uh, done four, but you can try it. I'm not sure what will happen. I think there's just going to be more stress. Same with that side. And you want to do that for the feet. One, two, three times again. And other side. One, two, three. I'm sorry about my dog working. I hope you're not wearing headphones. If you are, I'm very sorry. Okay, so now we should have something like this. Uh, now all we need to do is the tail. So we're going to do this on our hook. So I'm going to move my camera over here. So take a single band and wrap it around three times. So one, two, three. Now take double bands. Just grabbing a, another black. Or, yeah, another Put those on the hook and pull those on. So you may know this, uh, and basically we just repeat those steps. And I only have two more to do this with. Which I think is fine. I didn't do too many on the other one, just the entire rainbow, you know. Okay, and take that off. I'm just going to grab another block to make it even, you know? And now I have to grab another one because I grabbed two blocks. Okay. Um, so here, so you can already tell the tail is mostly black. I think this is a good tail ring. Okay. Pretty good, you can make it longer if you want. Uh, this is how long. You can, uh, my other one is, you can count it if you want. So, uh, I did six on the other one, counting the cabin, so one, two, three, four, five. I'm one short, and that makes me want to fix it. It's a younger lion. Pretty sure I even made him a little shorter. So let's move the camera back. 
without dropping it. And you want to take your lion and put him on that. There you go. Push that down and pull. And there you go. You have your tail. And actually, this one is a little longer than I wanted it to be. So this will probably look perfect. And now I actually have two more black bands that we're going to make. Oops. No, 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 it's going to fall. That we're going to make in the eyes with. Um, I kind of shaped my camera in an awkward position. Um, if you know how to make the eyes, and you can go ahead and... Oh, there we go. Okay. Uh, so now you want to take single bands and put it here. So uh, on the middle, like... So there's the bottom of the face and the top. So you want to put it in the middle of those. And around, around two, uh, four times. So two, three, four. Uh, and same for the other side. I'm really just focusing on my camera not falling. Um, you focus on doing it four times though. Two, three, and four. And now we're going to be adding the triangular bands, and then we can hug. Uh, as you guessed, my triangular bands are all going to be black, since it's the color I have most of. Um, one of these days, I'm going to be like wishing I didn't use all this black for this. Okay, so now we're going to start with the bottom. So first here, you want to take your black bands and put them above your feet. And then you want to pull that, and then instead of just leaving it like this, you want to... You wanna, Pull that, pull that up. And then up here, you just want to do a normal triangle. So, like, are you serious? Maybe I, it's my fault. It's it's my fault, guys. And then just pull that up. Same up here. And you do not want to put it up here. Now we're going to go up here. And put it at the bottom of the face. And here. Uh, this is the last band you'll need on this whole entire thing, um, right? Is it? Yes, it is. It is the in last band, so you can put back your bands, um, and here. Now you do not need any more bands, and now we're going to be hooking. The rest of the time we're hooking. Okay, hooking is my least and favorite, uh, least favorite and favorite part, so, um, uh, yeah, so you want to go under the cat band, go around, and grab the two bands. Go around, pull down without breaking your bands. This is, for some reason, a little harder for me here. Probably because I'm literally in the middle of my camera stick parts. <laughs> okay, now same here. Grab those. Pull over, pull down, and put it down. Usually we'd be hooking upwards, um, but now we're hooking downwards. Okay, so now we're going to grab these bands, and if you're using black on the face, it's going to look really um, bad because um, your eyes are black. Unless you didn't do that, like a smart person. I use black, and I'm just realizing that. Anyway, so you just want to... Grab the cap band, not the triangular band, the cap band, and pull over. Push the triangular band down if you need to, and then grab, you can grab it four at a time, or you can grab them four, you can, sorry, you can grab all four of them, or you can do them one at a time or two at a time. I'm grabbing them, you know, just any order, really, doesn't really matter. Um, and now we're going to start hooking the entire thing. So here, just go under the cap band. And grab the two double bands. I mean the two bands. Except they're basically, you know, part of one hole, I guess. And then same with the other foot. And you can go ahead and just do the middle right now. Because it's the easiest. Go around. There. So there's nothing to go under in the middle just grabbing and putting upwards 
there you go. Oh, sorry, that wasn't in the camera. Okay, so basically I just hooked all the way up here to here. And just grabbing, so they pretend there's bands here, okay? And then pull over. And now here you want to go under the triangular band, go around, pull, and put up. And you can do it, do this in any order you want, as long as you're not like, so you can't just go up here and hook up. You have to do all these, and then you can hook here. So, you know. But you can do whatever row you want first. There. Now I'm going to do this row. So under the triangular band and pull up. So really the only thing you're going under is the triangular band. Triangular band and pull up. Triangular and pull up. And there. Okay. Now you want to go under the arm bands. Grab the two bands you're using for the shoulders, go around, pull up, and put it there. Um, here, you want to go under, go around, and pull there. Now we're going to do the neck. So anyway, your body should look like this with your tail. If you didn't want to do tail, that's fine. You can just pretend it's in the back. Um, a lot of my designs don't have tails um, when they should, but... You know. Okay, so now there's a lot of stress on this. Um, so you want to be very careful if you're using a delicate hook or bands. Uh, so you just grab your double bands for the neck. Uh, go under everything. It's very bad if you have the wrong ones. You have to grab the right ones for this. Um, and pull up. I recommend putting your finger like here so that you can... Make it, there you go, I made it. And uh, so, as you can see, if you grab the right ones, both of these should go in a teardrop shape. If one of them isn't, or if they both aren't, then you grabbed both or one of the wrong bands. So here, you just grab the top two, which are these white bands for me. And, oh, I actually grabbed a band. I don't know what that was. What? Oh, I didn't, sorry, I don't know. I feel like I saw a little black band. And you want to pull it to wherever it leads or wherever it feels like it. you need to put, put, put it. Grab the next two and put it here. And just completely ignore, ignore the mane. Then grab the next two and pull it upwards. If your mane's a little crooked, don't worry. You can fix that. If it's literally falling off, then you should probably do something about that. But for me, everything's fine. Again, I'm going to do the middle first because there's nothing to go under here. And grab those and pull it up. Then we're going to do here. The main can get really distracting, which is what kind of makes this design just a little hard. But as long as you don't, um, you know, accidentally grab those and pretend and act like it's a one of the, you know, bands there, then it should be fine. So really just go under everything, grab the two bands around, make sure you're going around. And pull upwards. Also, I do realize this one's a little weird, weirdly shaped, but hopefully it's all fine. Just grab these two, and now we're about to close everything off. So give yourself a round of applause. Your face look like should look like this. Hopefully, your eyes don't blend in with anything. Um, I usually say to make sure your eyes don't blend in with anything, but I was just you know <laughs> really fast this time, so I was like speed round. Okay, so anyway, grab your two bands there. Oh, uh, there should be nothing there to, you know, stop you from grabbing them. So there's nothing, no bands you have to go under. Then here, go around and pull over and put it in the middle. Now here, there's a lot of stress and you might grab the wrong ones. I just went blindly, so, um, you know, I might have grabbed the wrong, right ones or wrong ones. Um... But they look the same color, so... Wait, did I grab triple vans? Oh my god, I I grabbed triple vans. Okay, now I have to fix that real quick. And my camera is half off the table. So... Okay, that one feels right. That one also feels right. That one does not. Get back on there. You don't, you don't belong here or whatever. Okay, anyway, so now you should have these two. I think I grabbed the right ones. Okay, so now you want to grab the bottom two, pull over, 
and just pull these. And yes, I did grab the right ones because it's tightening. Pull. And now you can take everything off. Uh, you can tighten that a little more. Just make sure it doesn't break. Uh, people usually fast forward this. I'm not going to. Um, because, you know, why not? Just, you know, it's fun taking it off together. Pulling everything off. Uh, you don't really have to be too delicate, just not jabbing it off. Uh, you can also use the bottom of your hook if you have something like this to pull it off. I don't like to because it scares me, but if you want to try it, it's fine. But if your thing breaks, I'm sorry, I've never tried doing it. Okay, um, this one's probably not going to have any eyes at all, but it's totally fine. You know, no eyes is, it's a new trend, okay? Um, so just pulling the main back. If some of the main gets stuck in the head like this, just pull whatever is causing it from the opposite side. So, where are you band here? So yeah, just pull all the back bands. So what I did is I just pulled all the back bands there. So they shouldn't fall out. They aren't for me, so that's good. Uh... The top of the head's kind of weird. Nope, that's that, that. It's nothing. Oh no, I'm fine. I mean, and you should be fine too. So there you go. You have your line. It always turns out weird on camera, but it looks really cool in real life. I'm not gonna lie. And I'm still trying to find whatever created that black band. Where where are you? Where do you come from? Get out. Okay, so it's bottom white band. Okay, anyway, uh, I'm going to find that band that's causing all these problems. These problems. Um, Here are the two. I love how this one's kind of small, and it's like a baby, and they're super cute. Anyway, I'm going to take that off somehow. Um, Here, you know what? I'm just going to cut it with scissors. Let me go get some. Okay, cut it off. There you go. And now we have two of them. The eyes do kind of stand out a little bit, but they're, they still look like that. Uh, anyway, they're super cute. I love them a lot. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Also, um, I realized I forgot to do the ears just now. Um, but wait, so this is what you should is looking like you don't hate it okay right you don't hate it it's cute hopefully you like it i'm really sorry i forgot the ears i just realized that and i'm kind of in like frozen motion like i forgot the ears um but yeah i did forget the ears you can make it again and put on ears or destroy this one and make it with ears hopefully it's not that furious if you're doing it beforehand then you can go ahead and make the ears but hopefully you know how to make ears um you can watch some of my other tutorials, like the mermaid bear. That's how I did my ears. Um, but hopefully you like it without ears. Um, yeah, just just consider it consider it as a special lion, okay? Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. These are my two lines, and please like and subscribe. It would really help. Bye.